all right um no it's kind of weird uh post some videos on back-to-back -back days but um something i've been wanting to do for a while my um i'm gonna show y'all what my mom she got me for christmas uh whenever she came her and my grandma came back in uh either late january or early february i can't remember but so that's what this video is going to be about is just showing you the the things that she got me for christmas so i hope y'all enjoy So the first thing she got me, she knew I like cast iron stuff. Um, so she got me this cast iron loaf pan. It's uh, from Cracker Barrel, old country store. Um, I think it needs a little bit of, it'll need a little bit of cleanup. But so yeah, it's pretty, pretty nice heavy duty um, little loaf pan. So I was pretty excited to get that. Um, these other things, I don't know if I'll ever use them to cook with, but they got, she got me the, two of these, um, cast iron skillets. It's made at the foundry there in the, close to the town that I went to uh, high school in. And so that's, and they still live in that area. It's uh, Coffinville, Kansas. So she, they got, they make these at the foundry there. So this one is about the Brown Mansion, which is kind of like a, a big tourist thing there in Coffeeville. So I think these, thought these were pretty neat. Um, like I said, I'll probably won't use them to cook with. I'll just, you know, hang them up for decorations or whatever. But yeah, so that, I thought those were pretty neat. Uh, the other one, it's another, uh, it's another skillet too. It says something different on it. Yeah, that's the the foundry there in Coffeeville. So this one, yeah, it's just a uh, 150 years that I guess Coffeeville was founded. This is for 2019, but she bought this <laughs> back before Christmas. So, but yeah, that's pretty neat. I like them, so I'll probably, you know, have them hanging up in some of my other videos I do when I'm cooking with cast iron, so, like, kind of like decoration or whatever. My mom, she does a lot of uh, crafting stuff, and she's got a Facebook page, it's called Nana's Crafty Creations. I'll leave a uh, link to the Facebook page in the description. Um, if y'all want to go check her out, uh, she does a lot of with sewing embroidering um this other craft stuff that she goes to craft fairs and stuff and sells all of it so uh y'all go on and check her out and who knows maybe you'll buy some so but yeah i'll uh leave that in the description below y'all have a good day this is amazing